Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of the Python Flask. Today we are going to learn record the video from a webcam using Python, OpenCV and the Flask. So those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel. And if you like the video, please do like, share and comment on my video. Let's get started. So here we have the Flask code. So I'm going to add this Flask code for here. Let's copy paste this. And this is the last where, where we are going to take a screenshot of the or you can say about the image or clear, click the picture from the webcam and save that into our local storage. This is the last video, right? Now we have to do with the video recording. Okay. The next one that we have to update the code of the index HTML, right? So here we go going to update the code. Okay, let's try to launch this. Let's open the link. Okay, so start recording and the stop recording, right? And uh, let's have a look at the format, which format we are going to save it so that we can open it. So here we go with the format. Let's have a look the format of app.ty. So it is AVI, I'm going to make it MP4. Okay, so wherever we can see the recordings, right? Where we can upload and just check the recordings. Okay. Yeah, let's try to record the video. And uh, here we go with this one. I think we need to restart, I guess. Detect changes and reload. Okay, fine. On, then we are going to close it. And let's go with. Okay, so now record. Let's start the recording from here. Recording started, and now I'm going to stop the recording with this symbol right here. Okay, now stop the recording. Okay, done. Let's have a look. So, recorded videos, and here is output.mp4, and here you can see that. Uh, Two minutes. This is the vid uh, which folder that we have recorded. Just give me a second. Is not supported codec. Here we have some issues with that one. That is open CVFP tag XID is not supported with the codec ID12 on the format MP4. Okay, I think it's go with the EVI4. So let me just redo that one. Okay, let's try to uh, control C. Let's close that one webcam and let's restart again. And here we go with this one start recording and stop recording. Okay, let's have a look. Here you can see that output.avi and output.mp4 is also there when we have do the recording right here you can see that is also working you can at the last we said that this one so this is also recording this is also recorded right so whenever you try to record anything so you can just go with that part right so start recording stop recording right so let's have a look and dive into the code level so from flask flask render time page response and the request cv2 and initialize with the flask app okay initialize the variables for the video recording is recording false out none generate the frames again and global is recording and the out we have defined if it is true success then we're going to read the camera if not then break okay if is recording then writing the frames okay and this is the code for writing the frame part right and the route index, we are going to render the index template and the video feed, we are going for the first, we are going to open the camera. Okay, so then we have to adding the button that is start recording, stop recording. And when you click on the start recording, so global is recording out. So I'm going to video writer XYD to write the video. Okay, 
so it will start the writing the video when i try to stop the video then uh, out is release is recording false return 204 okay and then main application in the index.html so here we are going to open the first image id video we here we are just launching the webcam over there and then button id would be strong uh, start id start recording and the stop one so we are going to uh, first we will take the button that is start the stop when i click on the button that is start recording so now after the clicking disabled and uh, fetch the api that is start recording that is post request after this we are to have the stop recording button when i click on that one then disable the start recording because we are going to do the stop recording okay and we are calling the api that is stop recording method is post okay done very easy very simple any doubt any query in that do let me know in the comment section thank you so much for watching this video and don't forget to like share and comment on my video have a nice day